ASM Foundation organized a four-day conference on climate resilience and sustainable development of horticulture in collaboration with Chandrasekhar Azad University of Agriculture and Technology. The conference had collaboration of the Dhanuka Agritech Limited, Gurugram, GISL Jalgaon, the CHAI and the TAS New Delhi. Dr. Ajit Singh Tomer, Vice President, Head R&D of Dhanuka Agritech Limited, chaired one technical session on plant health management for climate change resilience and sustainability in production and delivered a keynote presentation on strategies crop solutions for climate resilient and sustainable production in horticulture. Subodh Kumar Gupta, Chief Manager of Marketing of Dhanuka Agritech Limited, delivered a presentation on Dhanuka Innovative Crop Solutions Strategies in Horticulture Crops, sharing results of the new 9-3 products range like Kirari results or late blight of potato crop. The conference witnessed participation of 350-plus delegates across India, including farmers, and received valuable input from all stakeholders through knowledge sharing to develop strategic recommendations for developing policy frameworks and understanding the current state of horticulture. Hello, I am Shikha Yadav. You are watching Agribusiness News. Let's start with the latest updates. MC Dominic, founder and editor-in-chief of Krishi Jagran and Agriculture World, has been the chief guest on the celebration of World Environment Day by Harit Seva Mission at Chandni Chowk, New Delhi. He praised Harit Seva Mission for its contribution to the environment. Harit Seva Mission distributed 5,000 plants for free. The whole event was sponsored by M.K. Gupta, chairman of KPDK Builder Private Limited. I say, Abhi, Harita Seva Mission, kya kaam kar rahe is area me, this level par local me hum ekhata karke kaam karega. Ye change ho sakte. Ye bada bada event se mujhe nahi lag rahe environment ka samrakshan ho sakte. Ye ho sakte kaise local me, hamara kaise RK Gupta ji aur MK Gupta ji aur Vivas ka saaf saare milkar kaam kar rahe. Hamare local colony me maximum poda lega ke. इसी के लिए लक्ष्य में आज हमने एक विशाल भंडारा रखा है जो की हम पेड़ पौधों के माध्यम से कर रहे हैं हमें अधिक से अधिक ये पेड़ पौधे प्रदूषण को बढ़ाएंगे नहीं कम करेंगे अधिक से अधिक हमें भर पेट ऑक्सीजन मिलेगी में जो दिवस मनाया जा रहा है उसके उपलक्ष्य में कार्यकर्ताओं को सम्मिलित है उनको बधाई देता हूँ महत्वपूर्ण काम जो एक तरफ से पौधे लगाने का वृक्ष लगाने का पूरी दुनिया में इसको रखा गया है उन्होंने शुरुआत की है और एक बड़े रूप से की है मैंने देखा शुरू में इतना ही प्रोत्साहन था कि यहाँ के जो आने वाले लोग हैं वो एक एक आदमी को क्या करना चाहिए जो पौधा लेकर जाओ करूँगा एक एक आदमी के इस पौधे लगाने से पूरे विश्व में उसके क्लाइमेटिक कंडीशन को वायु जलवायु को इतना बता रहे हैं पूरा का पूरा प्रभाव पड़ेगा Fourth Fresh India Show 2022, organized by Media Today Group, India's leading agro trade events organizers and publication house, concluded at Welcome Hotel by ITC Hotels, Dwarka, New Delhi. S. Zafar Nakhvi, president of Media Today Group, speaks exclusively with Krishi Jagran and tells us why India is no longer an export-oriented country. We had the participation from uh, 11 countries. In two days, we had more than 200 delegates representing about 11 countries and uh, we discussed things from a very wide spectrum from cultivation techniques to logistics storage IT involvement automation till the time of exports promotion and not just that international cooperation as well as we talked about uh, import of fresh produce as well as export because India is no more just an export oriented country we are a world power we are becoming a world power and therefore we also need all kind of fruits and vegetables also present at the fourth India show 2022 Komal Jain founder of snow fresh farms shares a special message for women entrepreneurs in today's uh, this program it was wonderful it was so knowledgeable and especially uh, for women entrepreneurs like me we got a lovely lovely backing and uh, very uh, they give us a lot of confidence by awarding me with the fresh india award 
for a budding entrepreneur under organic sector today and uh, I encourage uh, all women especially to come up in this field of agriculture. There is a lot of scope here and uh, it's it's like a circular economy of uh, what we are talking about today there is more work more business uh, see everyone has their own set of things to represent so if the if uh, we have more people who are eating organic food we need more produce fresh produce which is organic we need more uh, cold pressed oils so to do all that we need more uh, farmers working with us we need women we encourage them to come and work with us in the fields and everything so they get a livelihood and confidence to run their lives Ajit Desai, Director of Management at Desai Agri Foods, an Innoterra Group company, speaks with Krishi Jagran about his experience at the 4th Fresh India Show 2020. We have a fixed price contract with the farmer and assure, uh, give technology to the farmer that how his productivity will increase and his income will be doubled. So, in 2001, we will यहाँ आने का मकसद ये है कि एक ही इंडिया में एक बड़ा इतना बड़ा फोरम है जो मीडिया टुडे जो कर रहे हैं कि उससे कई चीजें हैं लोग एक दूसरे को मिल सकते हैं क्योंकि कई स्टार्टअप इंडिया में अभी आए हैं तो वो एक दूसरे को मिलते हैं और एक दूसरे का जो एक्सपीरियंस है वो शेयर करके कंट्री को आगे ले जाए Present at the 4th Fresh India Show 2022, SK Sharma, MD of Global Agri System, speaks with Krishi Jagran on the diversity of participation from the Indian fresh produce industry the event witnessed. Here in this event, we are very happy to participate and we, uh, the knowledge partners, we find that the uh, audience here or the people who have come here, uh, both the speakers as well as the visitors, uh, are uh, from the varied backgrounds and uh, uh, it is very much beneficial since the people from all types of uh, backgrounds some processors the technology providers knowledge providers as well as the media uh, uh, type companies or the publications or related to agriculture and food processing are here so that is a very good uh, uh, effort that has been made by the organizers and i hope that this will go a long way in helping the people to network and uh, join with each other to come out with the, the solutions for this sector in a much more effective way. Mukul Sarin, Director of Global Sales at Keep It Fresh, working in the domain of shelf life extension technologies for fruits and vegetables, shares his views regarding the event with Krishi Jagrin, the associate partner for the 4th Fresh India Show 2022, organized by the Media Today Group. Uh, this year, the show has been even bigger and better, and they are lot of quality uh, people who have attended the audience has been fantastic and from different parts of the world um, the participation is humongous mm -hmm. and uh, i wish all the best to uh, media today and uh, mr both the nakvi brothers for this grand successful event the speakers have been of uh, ultimately you know excellent quality uh, there's been a lot of subject and the major disruption that is happening in agri-tech space and the views and uh, the sharings that have been given today. There's been a lot of learning and uh, I wish that India grows very quick and fast in the agri-tech uh, and this disruption happening continues. On the occasion of World Environment Day, Prime Minister Narendra Modi visited an event on Safe Soil Movement organized by Isha Foundation at Vigyan Bhavan. Sadhguru, who started the global movement in March 2022 to increase awareness about deteriorating soil health and bring about a conscious response to improve it, was also present. As a part of the movement, the founder of the Isha Foundation embarked on a 100-day motorcycle journey passing through 27 countries. 5th June marks the 75th day of the 100-day journey. Krishi Jagran's team was also present to cover the program. Krishi Jagran organized a webinar on the occasion of World Environment Day from 3 p.m. onwards with the theme Sustainable Ecosystem and Agriculture. The webinar streamed live on Krishi Jagran's official Facebook page. MC Dominic, founder and editor-in-chief of Krishi Jagran and Agriculture World, 
along with various leaders, agricultural experts, scientists and environmentalists discussed current issues, policies and future possibilities for sustainable ecosystem and agriculture of the planet. Something which is very important to all of us to understand that uh, if you want to achieve the ecological sustainability, we also need to understand that there is a climate change is happening. And the climate change is definitely is uh, creating a havoc to the agriculture. It is a havoc for everyone on the earth. What other people can do at a micro level is that, that if you can start inculcating this habit key, it's so if there is a birthday in the house or there is an anniversary or somebody is getting married, instead of just buying gifts and giving here and there, why can't we just start planting trees? And one thing which I noticed when I went to Iran four years back is that uh, 90 to 95 percent of the plants in Iran were fruit trees. And that is why Iran is one of the largest fruit uh, producing country of the world. And it's not a very large country. Uh, in, our, in our country, the mindset needs to be changed, I feel. World Environment Expo 2022 has been organized by the Green Society of India and Indian Exhibition Services with the support of the Ministry of Environment, Forest and Climate Change, Government of India and the United Nations Environment Program at Pragati Maidan, India. Krishi Jagrin is the official media partner for the Expo. The theme of the World Environment Conference is Save Nature, Save Future. Exhibitors from many countries participated in the event and presented their inventions and technology. Many such exhibitors spoke with Krishi Chagu. We, Bioshock Ventures, uh, an environment biotechnology company, we specialized in uh, sustainable environment management solutions by using nature-based solutions for uh, remediation of water bodies, lakes, contaminated lakes, uh, river, dump sites, and sustainable environment management solutions, actually. We work on various sectors in uh, lake restoration in Bengal, Jharkhand, and Tamil Nadu, Kerala, and various other locations also. As you can see some of the pictures here, which is uh, remediation by our floating islands and IoT devices, where we can monitor the water quality in real time. And also, we can uh, see the remediation process in a 100% natural way by using low carbon technologies. Nuzi Vedu Seeds Limited, one of India's largest hybrid seed companies, has launched a new product, NMH4144 Kranti Hybrid Maze. Nuzi Vedu Seeds team had a cake cutting ceremony to celebrate the launch. For more such agri updates, keep watching Krishi Chagrin Business. Thank you.